Well, that's always a chance, but the officer's under no obligation to provide you with the information. <laughs> no, what the officer's gonna do, first off, the likelihood that you're gonna get stopped when it's pouring down rain is pretty remote. And there are two reasons for it. One, the officer doesn't want to get wet issuing a citation. They're not entirely dim, right? And the other is that there are many traffic accidents, so the, re the, the resources of law enforcement are at a maximum devoted to traffic accidents and things of that nature. Traffic lights being out, actual physical crashes between cars, and those sorts of things. So there's not there are not as many resources to issue traffic citations. Rain does not, to my knowledge, change the speedometer readings. Most of the speeding tickets now are not issued by a thing called VASCAR, which used to track my speed in my patrol car versus your speed, even though you're going another direction. That just isn't used anymore. Today, it's laser and it's KA band. Uh, radar. So those are the two devices that are used. Now, if if you're speeding down the road and there's a police officer right behind you and they're trailing you, they can use that, but they're not required to show you anything. They're required, duty-bound, under certain circumstances because they have discretion to not issue you a citation. They have a discretion not to issue, to, to not issue even a warning. But here's a key feature. Police officers in training are told this. If you stop someone, you better issue them a traffic citation. Otherwise, they'll call your chief and tell them that they were harassed for no reason at all. Whereas, if you issue them a traffic citation, then they did it. And it's that simple. And there's one other step, and this is really important for women. We are also taught that if you stop a woman to issue her a citation, always issue a citation. Because if you don't, then she is likely to complain of sexual harassment. So every woman that I ever stopped, including the one that I wrote belligerent and bellicose on the citation, was a woman I stopped in Miami, and every one I stopped got a citation. Or I didn't stop them at all.